Hi Capricorn, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning into your weekly lovery. This will be a six card spread um, relaying some messages that can be helpful in regards to love. Um, otherwise, let's have a look and see Capricorn what's coming up around you in regards to matters of love. Okay, we've got the Ace of Cups, but that's reversed. So maybe something to do with renewal or cleansing, forgiving and healing. I think you're trying to move forward in a situation, but maybe turning your back on an opportunity to heal or forgive someone. Okay. Could also be turning your back on someone new who's willing to offer you a lot of um, a big emotional commitment. Okay, the Ace of Cups has, has come up twice and both times it is reversed. Um, Capricorn, so someone new, maybe even a couple of people are both offering you emotional connections, but you're saying no to that. Um, or it's that you're lacking an emotional connection in some way. The Moon is here, so it can be around a Cancer maybe. You have the King of Pentacles, which is Taurus. Um... What I want to say, though, in this corner, it looks like you're rationalizing everything this week. It's not so much feeling from the heart, Capricorn. It's almost like you're trying to convince yourself of the logic points in a, in a situation. Um, the Three of Pentacles is seen as a card of compromise and, and um, logic. And I think this is you coming up in this column as the Pentacles. And you're trying to build a wall and you're being smart about it, okay? I, Whatever it is that you're trying to build up, I think you're basing it more on logic and rationale rather than emotions. The King of Pentacles is reversed, and he's ruled by Venus, um, the planet of love. So what is it, Capricorn? You're either not feeling the love, you're not feeling the emotional connection, or you're trying to move forward with purely an intellectual, in an intellectual way. It's either you're not allowing yourself to feel all the feelings I don't know if it's maybe you're still in the building foundation stage, um, but these these aces that are coming up around you here to me would indicate that right now you're not allowing yourself. This is this is free flowing emotion. This is letting everything out. This is tension release. This is confession of feelings. Maybe someone has confessed how strongly they feel about you, um, and you might be withholding it. From these aces, I get the sense that this is not ready to love, not ready to submit, not ready to completely give your heart away, um, Capricorn. I don't know if you're not ready to give your heart away because you're still protecting yourself. Boats are symbols of protection. Uh, I don't know if there's still something happening or you're still linked to the past. There's still an attachment to someone that's preventing you from falling for this new person or opening up your heart again or putting yourself out there or dating again even maybe you've been divorced you've been separated maybe you've just been, you're just still very attached to someone um, and you you've, you you it's almost like you don't want to move forward or you can't move forward you know this is grabbing the bull the bull by the horns and taking control of our matters um, of love but he's reversed here so it's almost looking like he's hanging off the horns. He doesn't look, he looks in a compromised position when we read it in this way, when it's come up compromised. Again, this is a card of compromise or sacrifice. So you're sacrificing a connection or sacrificing loving someone because maybe of a past attachment. Um, if it's not a past person, past attachment, the moon can be like anxieties or things going on in the subconscious mind. Um, subconsciously we tend to do things act certain ways because of subconscious desires capricorn so it might be a week where you have to really look within and see where you're heading because again i feel these three cards are showing me that it's you're trying to be humble and grounded about a situation but you're trying to be yes practical and realistic at the same time um but with the Six of Swords, it's like you're moving forward in a rational way. I do think there's bonding happening. The Ten of Pentacles, like I said, is laying down solid foundations. I don't know if the past could come back unexpectedly as well, though. 
it's almost looking like they're bumping into each other. So you might bump into someone here. Or it's maybe you haven't thought about this person for quite some time or the feelings that you felt with them. And then suddenly this week something happens, you reconnect and this compromises everything. Or this will compromise everything for you. So maybe that's what the message here is saying um, with these cards that have come up around you. But I get the, the notion of building foundations. I don't know if this is like building trust or building a connection, but you can't build a connection if you're not emotionally going to devote yourself, Capricorn. So I do feel like you're revoking emotion or you're not. I don't know if someone has done something here for you that has made you do this purposely to them. There's, I don't know if you're trying to protect family or friends. You're trying to protect the people you love and care about for some reason. Could it be that you're with someone who is a little bit unhealthy for you, Capricorn, and you don't want anyone else to know? Um, the Ace of Cups can also be seen as tradition, marriage. This could be a decline of a marriage or rejection of some kind here. Either a rejection on your part or someone you're dealing with uh, this week. So you may be faced with that. It's not always a, a, a comfortable thing to be going through, um, but it definitely could be something that's coming up around you uh, this month, uh, this week. Um, or you're throwing, it's almost like you're throwing tradition out the way, you're throwing convention out the way, you're throwing away what's normal or what seems conventional and you're doing things differently maybe. Um, you're finding alternatives, I think, to this situation, um, Cappy. But I do see you, you hard at work. You're building the bricks. Each brick that you lay down is a memory, is a moment, is a is a factor, is, is trust, is love, is, an, is something that's going to build up to a bigger picture here. So it'll be interesting to see how that plays out. I will leave your reading at that though, Cappy. So thank you again for tuning in.